look like? Well, I'm going to show you. So right now, we're at the plus two diopter range, which is where I would say 70% of the time people spend their time. General screening, it's got a good balance between field of view and also sensitivity of fluorescence. But let's say you want to get really close and magnify things beyond what you can zoom in with the plus two diopter. So what I can do is in my diopter selection, let's choose the plus 3.5. This is going to allow me to physically bring the head closer to the sample, which is going to both magnify things and also make the system more sensitive to light because being physically closer means the light has less distance to travel back to the lens system. So what I can do is now that I'm at the plus 3.5 position, the LSV system has a parfocal zoom, so what I'll do is I'll zoom in all the way. And now I'm going to go ahead and focus. And because it's parfocal, when I zoom back out, it's going to stay in focus. So this is the height range roughly that you'll use for the plus 3.5 diopter. You can get a little bit closer, you can get a little bit further away, but this is about that height range. On the flip side, to do those larger overviews, we're going to need to use a lower diopter number. So let's say I want to get a larger overview of this t-shirt. I'm going to use the plus one diopter. So I'm going to choose plus one. And now I can raise the head up. And again, what I'm going to do is zoom all the way in, focus. and zoom out, and again it's going to hold that focus. So now everything's sharp, in focus, and I'm getting a much larger overview. If I wanted to get an even bigger overview, I could actually move the head further up and use the no diopter position. Thanks for watching. I'm Jake Kurth with Leeds.